So the learning model has three components. There's a core part that has the basic skills and concepts of quality and safety. Around that is really the opportunity to apply that in the healthcare setting and understand how best practices uh, manifest at the front line. And outside of that is really the opportunity uh, to have an experience where you design an intervention and try to make things better. Crossing all three areas is the capstone. Some capstones will live mostly in the experiential environment, but what we think is that experience should be grounded in the theory. You should see how it's applied in the clinical setting, and then you should have the opportunity to lead a specific project. Many programs in quality and safety may try to just cover the basics, cover the theory, cover different concepts and how care has improved. For me, as an educator, what I'm hoping for in my learners is that they leave the program with not just, I did learn this, but I feel different now. And our program is set up to really give people a mindset. How do I see a problem? How do I design something to try to improve things? And how do I implement that change? And if people have an opportunity to do that, I think they will be different. And some of our courses actually allow for reflection with other people about the process. And once you've had a chance to reflect, I feel like that makes people different. They see things and they do things differently as a result.